Making fairly odd parents. I'm at Nickelodeon. Things are going great. I'm walking into work in the morning. Do 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 do. Got my pencil in my backpack. I got my little fairy wand in my hand. I got my crown in my head. I'm walking. Actually, I'm flying in. I'm flying up the stairs. Do 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 do. So I fly up to my office. I'm making fairly odd parents. Things are going great. This is in the early 2000s, right? So fairly odd parents is really a lot of fun to work on. People are liking it. They're watching their TVs. Kids are going, Mom, Dad, it's the fairly odd parents. Mom and Dad sit down and shove the kids out of the way, and they watch the show, which is really cool. But then Nickelodeon says, Hey, Butch, guess what? I'm like, What? Does this mean you guys want to do more? And they're like, No, we're canceling the show and I'm like what so the show's canceled right and I'm like well that's really that's really too bad I'm like why they're like well we're canceling your show because there's no sponge in it and I'm like well I could put a sponge in it but there's already a show with a sponge and a starfish I can make I can make my show about a sponge and like a catfish they're like no no that, that's dumb and I went okay fine so they canceled the show and so we have a big rap party so we're all having a good time yay we have party hats on there's a big party there's a door with like the word party on you hear us partying magic wands are flying out so we have a big rap party I'm leaving the rap party I got my pencil I got my crown I'm flying out because you know I'm a fairly odd parent I'm flying out of the party and suddenly Nicholas Nickelodeon grabs me with a big Nickelodeon hook, and they, that's the sound effect it made, and they pull me back, and they say, but you know what, we've had second thoughts, I'm like, second thoughts about what, the sponge show, and they're like, no, we want to do Fairly Odd Parents again, I'm like, why, they're like, well, um, we might have acted too hastily, I'm like, okay, that's cool, so I come back to work the next day with the pencil in my backpack, Fairly Odd wand in my hand, the crown in my head, doo-doo-doo, fly upstairs, doo-doo-doo, go back in, that's the music I made, I go back up into my office, and I'm having a great time, and suddenly, they're like, but your show's going really great, I'm like, great, this is really awesome, I'm like, yeah, but you know what? What? Like, we really want to cancel the show again. I'm like, but, but, but why? You just picked it up again. I said, yeah, well, you know, the show is just, it's kind of over and, you know, well, it's not doing as well as that sponge show over there. I said, well, I had a sponge show. If you don't like the catfish, I can always put like, you know, I don't know, a trigger fish in there. Like, no, no, trigger fish, that's a gun. We can't do that. Well, okay, fine. So we have another rap party. Again, there's the party door and magic wands are flying out again. People are having a great time. Woohoo, woohoo, yay. That's happening and I'm leaving this party. It's party number two and I'm flying out, doop de doop doo and they grab me with the Nickelodeon hook again. And they're like, hey, Butch, you know, we may have acted a little bit too hastily and I said really you think and they said well you know what we love you and you're making Danny Phantom now but you know we really love Fairly Odd Parents because the ratings just keep going up so uh, would you please make some more Fairly Odd Parents and I said well okay that sounds good now I get my my backpack on again my pencil in my backpack but now I've changed it over to a stylus because I'm drawing on tablets now so put my stylus in my backpack crown on my head my crown now has wi-fi because it's the early 2000s so I'm flying up the stairs again doop 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 get up there make it Fairly Odd Parents having a great time and then they say but you know what I'm like what they say we're canceling your show again and I said, but, well, why are you guys stopping it now? It's still not doing as well as the Sponge Show. The Sponge Show is our Mickey Mouse. Oh, hi, Pluto. Hi, Patrick. I'm SpongeBob. And now uh, you're the Donald right. Duck of Nickelodeon. <laughs> They canceled for a third time. I knew in my heart that Fairly Odd Parents was never going to get canceled because I just knew it was such a great show. We had so many more stories to tell. We're having so much fun. And I'm like, fine, we'll have another rap party. So now we're at party number, what party is this now? Three. This is party number three. Party number three. There's the party door behind the door. This is a brand new door now, though, because the, door, the other door is kind of old. And there's magic wands flying out. Now there's kind of ghost ectoplasm flying out, too. This is around the time Danny Phantom was retired as well. And so Danny Phantom finishes, had a great time on that show. But Fairly Odd Parents, I'm like, well, this show could still go, but you never know. So I'm flying out of this party, party number three. Doop -a -doop -a -doop. But then you know what? The Nickelodeon hook there was again. Kuching! It grabbed me again and pulled me back. And they're like, "Hey, Butch, we still want you to do Fairly Odd Parents." And I said, "But why?" We took another look at it, and it's still doing really, really well. I said, "Well, okay, let's do it then, guys. That's fine. But are we going to keep canceling this show?" I'm like, "No, we'll never cancel it again. We, I promise, we'll never do that." And I'm back at work. I got my pencil in my backpack, got my crown with the Wi-Fi on. I go upstairs with the eye wings. There I am, and making the show, having a great time. And suddenly they say, "Butch, you know what? Your show, we love it. We're so glad you were here. We still just want to have you make new things for us." So okay. So I pitch him a show called Tough Puppy. Great, let's make that. But you know what? We have a rap party for Fairly Odd Parents again. But now it's kind of fun because Tough Puppy's standing outside the door and he's guarding it. And the Nickelodeon hook. There it is. It comes to get me. But Tough Puppy stops it. Clink. And he goes, you want this hook back? And I'm like, well, okay. Put it in. And he puts a hook in my shirt and they wheel me back in. So all through the 2000s, Fairly Odd Parents was sort of the train I was riding on. And all my other shows rode on top of it. Like Fairly Odd Parents was this big choo-choo train. And Danny Phantom was on there. Tough Puppy was on there. And Bunsen was on there. He was kind of the caboose of the train. Once in a while, they would all just jump off the train. And then Fairly Odd Parents kept right on rolling. I was the captain of one ship. Then I was the captain of two ships, three ships, four ships. But now, since I've left Nickelodeon, I'm going to be the admiral over a mighty fleet of starships. I'm not just going to do one show at a time. I'll be flying through the galaxy, dropping cartoon comedy bombs on all sorts of civilizations. They'll be upset and mean at first. The comedy bomb's going to drop, and they're going to be laughing, and they're going to want to make peace with all of mankind.
Okay, that's kind of an exaggerated version of the tale of the Fairly Odd Parents. It was definitely a roller coaster ride. We kept making the show. It did get canceled five times. They said, no more, you're all done. And just as I was finishing a season and, and thinking it was over, they would pick it up again because the ratings were so strong, because the audience, all of you, were so awesome and kept watching it. And I can't thank you enough for that. And I can't thank Nickelodeon enough for letting me have the chance in the first place. You know what? This proves that your identity is not in who you work for. Your identity is right here inside of you. You take your gifts with you everywhere you go. Remember that. Okay? All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I am so happy you're here on the channel. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget, art gives you power. Use it wisely. Hey, Heart fans, subscribe here to keep up with me, Danny, Timmy, Dudley, Bunsen, and the Noob Network, my new app full of cartoons, shows, and games. Download it here. Click over here to watch my most recent video and here to start a playlist related to this video. Whoa, check out that awesome fan art. To be featured here, use hashtag heartfanart and tag me. I'm on every social media platform known to man. Cartoon Butch out. Pencil drop.